Yeah. Hey guys, welcome to my channel. This is Game oh, of oh, This is Game of Gr <laughs> I almost hit my son in his balls. <laughs> Can you tie him in a knot? Can you tie him in a bow? <laughs> <laughs> you can come here now. I'm done. <laughs> uh, I'm not stopping the video because I was freaking hilarious. Yes. I'm putting that in. <laughs> I love you too. Okay. Well, back to <laughs> back to the video. Um. Yeah, that was funny. I almost hit my son. <laughs> so, um, here's the thing. I was trying to figure out, you know, what to play in that. I've been recording since 3 o'clock. I had to look because my headset, I'm charging my VR headset. Um, Yeah, I've been tr recording since 3 o'clock and it's already 5.15. I've been trying to play this game. Decided to go to a town to investigate and that was a bad idea. Because it's not like 7 Days to Die at all. I wanted to show you something. Um, I decided to do this. Now, I'm not sponsoring them or anything. But I decided to try this. Um, it's the new uh, Quest Plus program. Uh, it's only $7.99 right now. It's free. And yesterday when I was on here, it didn't have Green Hell. Now it does. So that's something they added. Uh, these are all the games that are on there on here now. I refunded, well, not refunded, but I asked for a refund for Ghostbusters. And there's one reason. I, when I woke up at 2.30, I was so excited to play it. I was so excited to play it. And I was playing it with this guy, and he was saying something about during the day, there's, like, little kids on there. And I'm like, oh, well, kids are kids, you know. No big deal. I went into a game with a six-year-old. Six, seven, and eight-year-olds. And they constantly were just singing the Ghostbuster song. And they were trying to tell you how to play the game. Even though you knew how to play the game, they kept telling you, no, 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 you can't do it that way. You got to do it this way. You guys zap the ghost. And I'm just like, oh, my goodness. So I asked for a refund. I am not gonna go into Ghostbusters and have to deal with a bunch of little kids that the parents don't want to supervise so they put a headset on a kid and say there you go and I have a grandbaby and when she was little I would let her you know experience it but I won't let her on it anymore I said you have to be 13 it even says 13 um this game, I, I cannot stop playing. I literally cannot stop playing this game. I will shut up so you guys can watch it. Alright boys, let's play the attack here. We gotta get the key and then we gotta go to the exit. Alright, I'm gonna try to take out this little spider looking thing. Do it John, take him out! Where are we going? Are we going here? Ooh, a chest. Oh, we got a card. Ooh! Do I need to save you? There's a card. You got a card? Okay, hang on. I got this. Oh, oh, oh. Oh. This game is better than I thought it was. When I saw this commercial, this advertisement, I was just like, wait. Okay, so it's a little board game and a bunch of little, you know, people doing cards and, you know, whatever, you know. I started playing it and oh, I cannot stop playing it. It is so much fun. And you know, um, you flip your hand around and there's cards and different cards do different things. So if you put out a card and roll the dice and you get a skull, you just got poisoned. Um, I've died a lot. <laughs> And a lot of the players are like, that's okay, that's okay, you're good, you're good. You could still move. Well, a lot of times I'm completely dead and I have to wait until they get out of that uh, dungeon and go into the next dungeon and then I'm back. 
Um, but yeah, I die a lot in that game. I'm learning. I'm learning. But it is so much fun. Oh my gosh, it's so much fun. Are you going for your walk again? My son went for a walk at 3 a.m. and got stopped by a cop. <laughs> and it was coming back at 3 and asked him. And my son was ready to beat him up. <laughs> my son was ready to kick his butt. And then he showed that he was a cop and everything. And my son still had his hand clenched. He was like, oh, no. I don't trust nothing. <laughs> yeah, he don't trust anybody. Um, even, you know, if the cop would have said, you know, I got to take you in. It's protocol, you know, type thing. Then I don't think my son would have attacked him. Yeah, yeah. But he'd be like, I don't know about this. I don't I can you call another officer, you know, make Tommy, sure it's make this, sure like, it's legit. Tom, if you see this, it's cool. We're cool. I nothing wrong. I, I, I told him about your channel, so Say what? I, I told him he asked me what I do for a living and I said I edit for you. So if you're seeing this <laughs> cool. <laughs> So you, hold up, hold up. I want to get this story because I didn't hear this before. I pulls up on me randomly, I stops. It's 3 a.m. There's literally no one else around. My first instinct is like, if they get out this car, I'm going to have to fight for my life. That's my instinct. Yeah. Either I'm going to have to run or fight for my life. So then when the cop stopped you and came out of the car, what did he say? He said, hey, hey, I'm a cop. He knew I was a little bit on guard because I was like, I was like, I had my back turned because I was towards him. Mm -hmm. I was towards him, I'm like, uh-uh, uh, sir. No. -uh. Sir, why are you pulling up? <laughs> sir, better stop. <laughs> and so then it was a cop and, and a cop, we, it was a cop and we were chilling. Uh, I thought I was gonna die, but I'm here, so we good! <laughs> so, the story short, my son told him about my channel. Yay, he's broadcasting it. Now the whole police station knows about Grandma. Woohoo! I'm in. I'm. I'm. Old. Oh. He just called me old. I love you too, you rat. <laughs> I love my son. He he's my he's my best friend. I'm telling you, my son's awesome. I love him so much. I'm so glad that my daughter had asked for a baby brother, even though she already had a baby brother. Um, her brother was three when me and my husband decided to try for another one because she wanted another baby. Um, so we went ahead and had another one, and we didn't even know it was a boy. Um, and then when I went for my ultrasound, I know this is a long talking video, but when I went for my ultrasound, found out it was a boy. I came home, and she lit up, and I said, I said, hey, sweetie. She's like, yeah. I says, do you want to know if it's a boy or a girl? And she just looks at me with these big, bright eyes and says, <gasps> It's a boy! And I said, oh, how'd you guess? And she says, I'm smart. <laughs> she was six. Um, I mean, my kids, they were around, you know, that age six. And they were just all over the place. They had so much energy. But the thing with me is when I had my kids, I had them play games. I had them go outside. I had them go play climb trees, act like a monkey, you know. Um, I just had them do activities where they would go out and play or, you know, they would meet new people, you know, go out and meet the next door neighbors, go out and see if you can find people, you know, do what you want to do, do what you like to do. Well, my son that edits my videos, he used to go hunt for snakes yeah yep grass snakes he would go out and he would grab the grass snakes and he would collect them he had a big bucket and he's like mom mom come here look see how many we have I look in there and there's like 30 or 40 and I said how are you gonna feed them 
I said, dude, they're going to starve to death and die. And he's like, oh, no, 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 Mom. We don't keep them. And I was like, then why in the world did you grab all the snakes? For fun, Mom, for fun. I said, well, what are you going to do? Well, when it gets dark, we let them go. I said, well, where are you going to let them go? In the backyard. Why would you get, why would you let loose 30 snakes in our backyard when you caught them wherever? Well, they'll find their way home. (laughs) So, yeah, he used to collect snakes. Um, My other son uh, was more into computers like I was. Um, Well, I still am into computers. Not as much as he is, though. Um, I told him that he should uh, get the degree I was going for. Um, But with my instructors telling me to do YouTube... I guess that's what I got to listen to. So uh, now the police station knows about my channel. Woohoo! <laughs> All the cops are going to watch my channel. My son is awesome. He got the cop to notify my channel. And now he'll write it down and he'll share it with his friends. Just like you guys. Okay, well, I did not expect that long talk in that um that was unplanned i was getting ready to play a game uh and i figured you know i might as well edit this all this uh gameplay out because otherwise you guys are going to hear me talk the whole entire time and there's no game i mean the game is like way at the end so i figured i would cut the game out and just do this video and then add this section onto the video. That way you guys can have story time with Grandma. <laughs> but this was not planned at all, guys. This is actually the next day. Um, which, it, it's funny how things happen. And you don't expect it to happen. It just happens. And the funny thing is, I was recording at the time. So it was perfect to get all this information um to you guys it's hilarious um i still watch it and i still smile and laugh it's 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 very entertaining how i would put it but um yeah i hope you guys like my channel thanks guys so much for watching and i will see you guys in the next video this is grandma signing out adios amigos Doses. I'm out. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. <laughs> Thanks for watching Gaming with Grandma.